day of St. Joseph. Today we celebrate St. Joseph the worker. I want to re reflect on St. Joseph. He really is a model for all men. He is the most perfect man that God has ever created. Probably the most perfect human being after the Blessed Virgin Mary. And today I want to reflect on his faithfulness. First of all, his faithfulness to God. Right? He is a man of prayer. We know this. And uh, in his dreams, he sees angels. He converses with angels. When angels command him to do something, he does it right away. For example, he, in a dream, the angel appeared to him and tell him to take the child Jesus and flee to Egypt, save him and his mother, because Herod is looking for him. And St. Joseph does that right away. He takes Jesus and Mary and flees to Egypt and, and protects them. And then when, he, uh, when Herod had died, um, the angel appeared to J Joseph and tells him, okay, you can, it's safe now. Why don't you take Mary and Jesus back to Nazareth? And, and so he did, right? So he was a man of God. He, he was faithful to his vocation as the, the spouse of the, the Blessed Virgin Mary and the foster father of Jesus. So he was faithful to his family, right? Um, and that's what we need. Men nowadays, we need men who are faithful to God, faithful to their vocation, faithful to their family. So we know that St. Joseph adored, venerated, loved um, the Blessed Virgin Mary, right? And so he treated her uh, with respect, with love, and, and served her, right? And so he was so grateful for her. So men, you too should treat your wife in, in that way, right? That she is a gift to you. So treat her with respect, with love, and, and with, uh, with gratitude. And then likewise, St. Joseph treated Jesus, right? This is his gift. This is God who became man. And so he, he fully fulfilled his role as a father as well, right? He protected Jesus. He loved him and raised him and cared for him and, and also worshipped him at the same time. And so we men, too, need to, to treat their, uh, their children um, with, with, with love, with care, with tenderness like St. Joseph. And then lastly, St. Joseph was faithful to his, his craft. We know that he is a carpenter, and that's what he works with his hands. He creates things. And so that's, that was his gift, gift, his charism, and he developed that. He worked, and, and, and he worked with his hands, developed his skills, developed his craft, used it for the glory of God and the good of others. So that's what we can learn from St. Joseph today. He is a model for all men. So men, let us look to St. Joseph. And today we look at his fidelity, his fidelity to God, his fidelity to his family, and his fidelity to his craft.